video, I have a few new rooted Brazilian cuttings to show you guys. But I wanted to start with this one, just so you all can get an idea of the growth potential of cuttings. So this is a node cutting. It has a 26 inch mother leaf. That leaf is pretty banged up, raggedy, and it is beginning to die. So you may want us to cut it off prior to shipping. But it has done its job because there are actually two new leaves. These are the new growth leaves. It has this one, which is an adorable perfect heart shape. And there is this one. Now, as you can see, the first leaf is about seven inches. It's a tiny new leaf with no fenestrations. And the second leaf is almost twice its size and has the start of fenestrations. So just judging from that alone, you can tell this cutting's leaves will grow exponentially larger. That is how the new growth will progress each new leaf will be exponentially larger than the previous leaf. And in a very short amount of time, it will catch up to the size of the mother leaf and even supersede it. It may be hard to tell now, but this will be a very large cutting. So how can I be so sure? Well, I'm going to show you a cutting that we listed last July. It actually sold right after we posted it back in July, but due to a variety of scheduling conflicts between us and the customer, plus the start of the winter weather where he lives, we actually still have this cutting. So this is what it looks like in July. A 26 inch mother leaf and a baby sprout. And this is what it looks like just over six months later. Here's the original mother leaf. And here's the baby sprout. As you can see, there are many more new leaves. It has gotten to be very large. Now, rest assured, yours will not take this long to ship. Our schedules were just not lining up, so don't think I'm going to hold onto your plant for six months after you buy it. We will ship it right away. But you can see how quickly a cutting matures from a small node cutting into a large showstopper in literally a matter of months. And as a side note, I want to mention, don't be afraid of node cuttings. Many sellers offer node cuttings and top cuttings. The only difference between a node cutting and a top cutting is that a top cutting gets larger faster. But as you can see, a node cutting will get large as well. A top cutting continues its growth from the top of the plant where the leaves are already large. So that new growth will naturally be larger than a plant that has to start growing from scratch from a node. However, even though the leaves are initially smaller, as you can see, with the right growing conditions, a node cutting can get to a very large size in a short amount of time. And node cuttings tend to be much cheaper than top cuttings. So don't be afraid to buy those while you're doing your online shopping. In any case, we are rooting both node cutting and top cutting Brazilians right now, and we'll post them for sale when we see some new growth. Here we have another cutting. It is well rooted and the leaves do have starter fenestrations. 
Unfortunately, we are running out of room in the back. So as you can see, this cutting is leaning toward the sunlight. Don't worry, it will reorient itself to grow upward under your grow lights. It's just trying to get as much light as it can under my plant hoarding conditions in the back. I do recycle my plant pots, so this is growing in one of those flat back one gallon pots. And it's a good idea to leave it in this pot for a few weeks, at least until your cutting acclimates to your environment. But after a short while, you can repot it in a more decorative pot if you choose to do so. In any case, this cutting is beautiful, but the current leaves and stems are somewhat beat up. That just comes with outdoor growth. But don't worry, you will grow a gorgeous, perfect plant in your controlled indoor conditions. begin offering water-rooted cuttings for many of our plants. There seems to be a growing Laka community that is interested in purchasing our plants. So we'll try to have some water-rooted options for each of the different types of plants we offer in the future. For now, this is our first water-rooted Brazilian cutting that we have to offer. So you're going to take it and do whatever lake y thing you guys do with it. Sorry, I'm not very familiar with it. To be honest, I have purchased some of those lake balls. I just haven't had time to play around with them. But here is our first water-rooted cutting, and we'll have more to offer in the future. Okay, for these next cuttings, I'm going to show you some examples of climbing Brazilians that we have to offer. We'll start with seedlings and small plants. If you order a seedling or a small plant that is climbing, we'll go through and look for ones with extremely strong climbing habits where the nodes are stacked on top of each other and the aerial roots are visibly climbing. obviously has a very strong climbing habit. It's just not quite ready yet. I need to see it produce a new leaf before I can feel comfortable shipping it out. But as you can see, 
it will produce a baby leaf very soon. The pregnant baby bump is protruding, so a new leaf is just a short while away. Cutting, we planted it low in the pot as an experiment. Basically, we wanted to see if the plant would use the walls of the pot to climb. And as you can see, it is literally climbing inside of the pot. The aerial roots do appear to be rooted in the soil if you plan on dividing it to share with friends and family. Or you can just keep it as it is and allow it to grow and climb in your home. Of course, you will need a more suitable totem for it than the inside of a plant pot, like a moss pole, a tall plank of wood, or you can allow it to actually climb your wall. is a very tall cutting. It is also very well rooted. It has been rooting for quite a while. And yes, there is a lot of new growth from the original cutting. This would be extremely easy for you to divide and share with your friends and family because as you can see, all of the nodes have extensive aerial roots. Thank you for watching. And as always, all of these cuttings and more in the future will be available for sale on our Etsy shop.